The Mountbatten Brailler has been an important tool for Braille learning, especially for early Braille learners, since 1990, and it continues to be developed. The basic concept of the Mountbatten Brailler, as compared to a mechanical Braille writer, is that the keys have a soft touch, which means that an early Braille learner does not require a strong finger pressure to actually form the Braille, and this encourages young Braille learners to start early in their Braille journey. It's an interactive device with speech feedback as we press the, uh, the Braille keys. It will also be spoken as well. So for example, if I form the letter C, it will, the machine will say C. I can adjust the volume or wear headphones. Um, and this way I can immediately get feedback as to what I have just typed and what I've just heard. So this makes it a very powerful early learning tool, very similar to the way other children learn to uh, read and write with pencils and scribbling and so on, forming letters and uh, just checking what uh, the shapes that they've made. So the Mountbatten can be used uh, in its quiet mode at the moment. We have it in its whisper mode where it's not actually producing a lot of noise when the braille is being produced. So I actually have the volume of the um, speech up high. I'll just reduce that down by turning the wheel here. I'll turn it right down to nothing and then we'll just listen to the actual volume of the mount pattern. And that uh, in the Whisperer model is actually a lot quieter than a conventional classic Perkins Braille. So that means that the Mountbatten will be used successfully in classroom situations without disturbing the other children. Now another really excellent feature of the Mountbatten is that it has connectivity to iPads, iPhones and so on, which means that a sighted person that's supporting the, bra uh, the blind child, even if they don't know Braille, can actually communicate with their iPad back and forth between the device. So if I take my Android phone, this is a Samsung, it could be an iPhone, and I just start this Mimic, it's a free, it's a free app. Um, I can actually connect the Mountbatten to the, um, to the device. You'll hear some, uh, I'll just turn the volume up on the Mountbatten because it will have a couple of comments as, as it goes. And when it's connected, it's now connected to my, uh, my phone. I have a couple of options. I can choose uh, to have a whiteboard or a chat session. I'm just going to show you the chat session first because this is very similar to ordinary social media and that makes it very familiar for parents and for teacher aides and so on. Without them actually knowing Braille, they can actually send messages back and forth. So if I just write hello Peter like this and I hit the OK button it will type hello Peter uh, in the uh, on the mount baton um, and for those of you that can read braille you'll notice that the uh, there is it's actually going in grade 2 braille with contractions now what about the blind child well what they do of course is they simply type back in braille like this and then we can see here that uh, on the, the right hand side we have their response here and this way we can have this chat session going on like this. Another feature that's very very useful is called the whiteboard. Now what this means is that you can type word for word and it will be instantly typed up here uh, but you can also paste into the whiteboard perhaps from the internet or from a, uh, a word processor into the whiteboard area and then have it embossed straight away on the mount pattern. So you can imagine that simple spelling lists and so on uh, could be um, 
written on here, embossed on the mount that and the child could read it. The child could also put answers back in braille here and they would come back on the whiteboard so that the teacher aid or the parent could see how they're progressing with their assignment. Now let's just do that now. So as soon as I hit the, um, the, um, the space bar, the word is embossed. And so on. So you can see that this is a very simple, very effective um, means of communicating with a blind um, early braille learner so that they can participate in the usual uh, primary uh, curriculum. Thank you very much.